Hi everyone, in this video I will show you that how you can fix Ghost of Tsushima game keeps crashing on your PC. I will show you guys the bad effective solution that will definitely fix your problem. So first right click on your taskbar and you will see the task manager simply open it. And guys here you just need to close all the background processes. Because when these processes are running this will consume a lot of CPU or the memory usage onto your PC that will cause your game crash. You will see the CPU and the memory on the top. If this CPU is memory is above 90% then it means it's the dangerous symbol you just need to close all the background processes then go to the details and here just click on the CPU on the top and it will give you all the processes that are consuming most of your CPU or the memory. So just right click on that all processes and just click on the end process T. And after that guys you will see the startup apps on the top just go to the startups and here you will see all the apps when you start your PC these applications start automatically without your permission and causing the lot of CPU or the RAM usage without your permission and that are causing your game crash while gaming so right click on that all application and just disable all of these applications then restart your PC and check your problem is fixed or not if your problem is not fixed then go to the window search and just type here the edit power plan now we are going to set the high performance power plan for your PC. You have to just search for it and just open it. Now here you will see the power options on the top. Just click on that. And on the left hand side you will see the create a power plan option. Just click on that. And here just select the high performance power plan. Then just click on the next option. And then just create the high performance power plan for your PC. Then just click on the change plan setting option. And then just click on the option of the change advanced power settings. And guys here you just need to scroll down and you have to look for the PCI Express. And then you have to look for the link state power management. Just open it. Here you just need to make sure guys that these two are off. Then just simply click on the apply. Then just click on the OK. Then just go back. Now guys we are going to increase our number of processes. Whenever our game need more CPU to run. So our maximum number of processes will be used. So go to the window set type the system configurations and simply open it. Now go to the boot then click on the advanced option then just click on the then just check this box and just select here the maximum number of processors you have. And guys if you have the 4, 8, 16 or the any value then just select here the maximum and then just click on the apply. Then you must need to restart your PC to apply these changes and once you restart your PC then just launch your game and see your problem is fixed or not. If your problem is not fixed then you can lower your FPS on your game and also lower your resolution and then launch the game again and hope this will fix your problem definitely. And if your problem is fixed please don't forget to like this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.